Do you want to know how to transfer files from your computer straight to your jailbroken PS3? Maybe transfer some cheeky mod yeah, menus boy. with the click of a couple of buttons. Well, my friend, this video is most definitely for you. In this one, I'm going to show you how to install any kind of file using the FileZilla application. Be sure to leave your boy a like and maybe subscribe to the channel for more PS3 jailbreak related content. No more waffle guys, let's get right into the video. The first step is go ahead and download the FTP server homebrew application. You can find this with the link in the description. Once you've got it downloaded, you will need to get your FAT32 formatted USB plugged in. If you do not know how to reformat your USB stick, I recommend doing a quick Google search on the subject. Go ahead and drag and drop the PKG file and eject the USB. Be sure to plug the USB stick in the right hand slot. Many people always ask, why the fuck does it need to be the right hand slot? Honestly guys, I have no idea but we're sticking with it. Once you've got it plugged in, you will need to enable your hen jailbreak. Or if you have a custom firmware, you just skip this step. Now head over to the package file manager, then click on install package files, then click standard, and you should see the FTP server download here. If you see two versions like on mine, just make sure you download the one at the bottom. Now you should see the FTP server application on your XMB, simply launch the app. After launching, you will see your IP address. This is what we will need to input into FileZilla in order to transfer files. Over on FileZilla, you will need to input that same IP address right here in the top left hand corner. After doing that, click on connect and you will see all of your files on the right hand side. All the same folders that you will find on the Multiman application. So there is no need to ever worry about that awful Multiman music ever again. I will now quickly show you how to transfer a file. Here I have this GTA 4 mod menu. All you need to do is open up the dev underscore HDD folder, then click on the game folder, the one in lower caps, and then you will need to find the correct regional code folder. You can find this information on the case or the disk of your games. Once you've found that, simply open up this folder and then you need to drag and drop that mod menu here. And it's as easy as that, guys. I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial. As always, be sure to hit all the buttons on the way out, big boy. Any support is appreciated. Cheers, guys, and peace.